on guys it's MKC technology here also known as MKC gaming in this video I'm gonna be talking about what is gonna be replacing Cygen mod and I'm also gonna be doing an app review on a new app that has been out for a while now called live.me before we get started if you haven't subscribed to my channel please be sure to sub subscribe to my channel now like for more videos comment down below on what you think about this video but try not to put any bad comments with that being said let's get started now the first thing we're going to be talking about is what is going to be replacing Saijin Mod. Currently, Saijin Mod is going to be stopping at CM13, and a new a new OS is going to be replacing Saijin Mod. So let's get into what is going to be what is going to be replacing Saijin Mod. So here you will be here on this page uh, that I've brought up on screen is the new OS that is going to be replacing Saijin Mod. Let's go back one page. And the new OS is basically Lineage OS. Now Lineage OS is going to be replacing Saijin Mod basically, basically because I think Saijin Mod wants to replace the OS or something or just wants to bring something new other than Saijin mod and S Lineage OS 14.1 is basically going to be Android Android 7.1.1 Nougat on a custom OS and from here if we go to update and uh, build build prep you go here you scroll down and go to the the download portal and then click on these three bars right here and you will see the the devices that are now compatible for this new OS now currently these are uh development builds or unofficial builds for the these devices so the current devices that are available are the Nexus 6P Angular the Nexus 5X Bullhead, the Motorola G4, G4 Plus, Athene, the Nexus Robin Ether, the Nexus, I mean the OnePlus One Bacon, and the Redmi 1S Ar Armani. I don't know how to say that X I A O M I word, uh, but I know it's Redmi Redmi One S, and then those are the devices that are currently uh, have prep builds or unofficial builds for the Lineage OS fourteen point one. Lineage OS, which is also Saijin Mod, is going to be working on official builds for all the devices that Saijin Mod currently has on let's say Saijin Mod 13.1 and they're going to be porting those devices to Lineage OS 14.1. With that being said, let's actually get into the app review that I, that you guys have been waiting for for so long. Now, the app review that I'm going to be doing an app review on is this new app, like I said, that has been out for a while now called Live.me. Let's open this app up, and when we open this app up, you will be brought up with a ad. Just wait for it to count down to zero, and then skip the ad. And then you will be brought up to this page where, you, before you enter the app itself, you will need to sign up. For the app, you will probably be you will probably be able to sign up through Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, or your phone, or just click more options to sign up through email. I suggest signing up through email, then connecting your social media accounts through the app itself. From here, you will be brought up with other people's live streams that they are doing right now, and from here, you can see how many people are watching. So currently this on this girl with the dog ears right here there are 21.7 million people watching her at this second and you could just scroll down and look at other people's live streams and stuff like that from here say your friend does live streams on live.me you can go here and search for that person's live stream and you can categorize those 
people's live streams through music and other categories. So let's get into categories real quick if I can. So here, this is the music category. You have the dance, adventure, comedy, lifestyle, and entertainment, beauty, art, gaming, and other. And then you have chat, sport, and then fashion. From here, you can go into your inbox and say, oh, look, somebody's following that I am following somebody or somebody's following me. And then you have your system messages from live.me. Uh, developers that says congratulations you have now been leveled up to level three let's go back if i can and then re you can go reply with comments nobody has commented so far since i just created this account and then i have my profile if you're wondering who that girl is right next to me that is my best friend uh i have two replays that I did two days ago, which was on Saturday, which is the first one. And no, actually, that's the one I did yesterday. And then the one I did two days ago is the one with 34 views. And is, well, well no. Hmm. From here, you could do your daily check-ins where you can get extra XP. And then you get a gift. And then, which is, I'll get my gift tomorrow. And then uh, I'll get... 30 xp the day after that i get my gift and then the gift right here where you see the coins that's basically if you get coins you can do coin drops and it depend but and it depends on how many coins you get but in order to do a coin drop you probably need around 700 coins in order to do a coin drop so let's do let's go back and then you can go into your activities and see how many people has watched your live stream and Basically, oh, uh, basically, these are the people that watched my live stream yesterday. If yesterday I said there were 34 people watching, I mean, 32 or 31 people watching my live stream yesterday, but I don't know about that. And then they, you do have your replays from yesterday. Uh, Live.me does record your replay so you can watch it back. Uh, you have my current profile picture, or this is the picture I load. I just uh, what you call uploaded to Instagram, and then they do scan your, uh, let's say, pictures in your phone, and then you can do whatever. Which is which I believe is kind of creepy because I don't want my pictures to be showing up on uh, Live Me. And this is a little funny thing that I found on Instagram. And yeah, uh, this is my. Well, that's my Xbox whole thing. Let's actually click on this. Uh, can't actually do nothing with these pictures, but it's a little picture from our car extra facing and other stuff like that. And this is a little bit creepy. Now, this is actually a fight for it at my school, and a little bit of recordings they do. It looks like the. It, it, since you are uh, since I'm connected to social media and other accounts on here that they will s scan your stuff But which again, I believe is a little bit cre creepy. I do have 10 coins on here From here you can also go into your moments, but I'm not gonna get into that right now You can connect different accounts. Let's go into connected accounts and From here you can connect your Instagram your Twitter, your YouTube, and your Facebook. So let's go into my Instagram real quick. And for here, you'll be brought up with my Instagram page. Please be sure to go ahead and follow on my Instagram page if you want to go ahead and follow. Here, then you, we can go on my Twitter page. This is my Twitter page. Please go ahead and follow if you guys want to follow. And then you have your, my YouTube page right here. Please be sure to subscribe to my YouTube channel. If you want to subscribe to my YouTube channel, I also have a secondary YouTube channel called MKC Gaming. So please go ahead and subscribe to that YouTube channel. And then I have my Facebook page. If you guys want to contact me through my Facebook page. I do do Instagram Vine compilations, so if you guys want to send me any Vines off of Instagram, please be sure to send me through my DM on YouTube or Facebook or Instagram if you guys want to. Let's get into moments right here, if we can. 
Uh, hmm, let's see what this is. So it's basically nothing. Uh, I have three diamonds, I think. I don't know what this is. You can change the name. Yeah, you can change the name of certain things. You can change the gender. Uh, and then the birthday and stuff like that. And we can go back and then we can go into settings right here. Notifications. Receive message messages from strangers and stuff like that. And this is other message alerts. You can go to find friends. Contacts. Uh, I don't want to get into that right now. Facebook friends. So that is basically I'm not going to get into that right quick right now. But we can do feedback to send feedback to live.me. And then we could block we have a block list where you can block other people. You can rate them on Google Play and verify user by criteria. And then from here you can also log out. You can also check how many fans you have, how many diamonds, how many coins, and the level you are currently at, and how many people you are following, and the replays you currently do have. And if we click on levels, you can go into how you can level up and what you can do to level up also. Now, I hope you guys enjoyed that video. Please be sure to like this video, comment down below, and subscribe to my YouTube channel. Well, both my YouTube channels, which are MKC Gaming and MKC Technology. And with that being said, you already heard my YouTube names. I'm out. Peace.